the combo I like to call Rocky Mountain Oysters. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yep. Google that one, kids. <laughs> <laughs> or if you're in a South Dakota, just go and have it for breakfast or have it for dinner like you did for breakfast or something. <laughs> well, there we go. It is time for game number two, Anarchy versus SK Telecom. Who takes it? Let's find out. <laughs> Rubber up. <laughs> Well, Which is how you would pronounce it if you're reading the Korean characters. It's true. For the record, Mickey uh -oh. coming in behind Mickey. Faker going in, a little bit of a bait here. Faker getting ignited, though. There's a flash from Mickey. Flash knockup from Bangi. Can Faker get this kill? Mickey turning around. That's still a lot of damage onto Faker. Oh, but first blood still goes to SK Telecom. Bangi picking that one up. Oh, Wolf condemned against Wall. He's actually taking a lot of damage. There's a play as well. Bang able to step up and do a little bit with auto attacks. And wow, knocked away Song Yoon. Wolf trying to keep him away here. This is a little bit crazy. Okay, this fight's still going. Sun Snowflower has to flash. Bang flashes for the auto. Lyra comes in a little bit too late. No, he doesn't come in too late. Gets the kill. This game's getting a bit silly already. Song Yoon trying to come in for the kill, but there is Bengi not able to engage on that though as Wolf has to flash to get away. Oh, Faker gets grabbed. This could be bad. Faker getting played as well. Flashes away. Shockwave brings it back in. Oh, still can't make it out of the damage from the Ignite, though. But here comes SKT Marin <laughs> and Wolf as well with that two-man pulverize. Mickey could be in a bit of trouble, but no, Marin not able to really do the damage here. Ixu teleporting down as well. Oh, Wolf, goodbye. SK Telecom, come on. Come well, on, Wow, guys. Marin just... Bengi did in the early game to take that. Now they're going to try and make a play well. Equalizer's wow, down. Great Snowflower job. Snowflower is really hitting the death sentences this game. And Marin, he's not going to make it out of this. A kill for Snowflower here, but he deserves one, man. He's been really making some great skill shots around the map in the last few minutes. It's a little bit of a boost in damage for SK Telecom, which helps mitigate uh, you know, a little bit of the edge anarchy. As O'Lira coming over the wall after Wolf. Snowflower's right there. Another hit death sentence. Wolf able to get out of that one, though. Oh, right in the bang over the wall. Snowflower could be in a bit of trouble here. Mickey coming in, gets exhausted. Faker coming down. There's a kill for Faker. Onto the support. Up, oh, but responding. Mickey able to take out Wolf. Just has to pop his ult and his flash to get out of what was it? Whatever, a 1v1 versus Song Yoon, who just tried to engage him right there. Oh, Mickey coming in to scout out this blue buff, but they're not going to find it. Wow, a grab onto Wolf. Wolf caught in the gravity field as well. The box going to go in for the headbutt. Pulverize here, but Lyra's going to zone out Bang. Bang's still low health here. Bang actually going to get taken out by Lyra. Faker manages to get the kill onto Snowflower. Bang's still alive for the moment anyway. Can he make it out though? Mickey goes down. Meanwhile, Lyra able to get that kill finally. Wolf comes down, gets the exhaust onto Lyra. There's a pulverize as well, too, but he needs the rest of his team there. Bengi coming in, and now Lyra a little bit on his own. And here's a skirmish that did not work out terribly well for Anarchy. They did get the kill onto Bang, but that's that's about it. They gave up three in return. Just be patient. You're already winning the game. Well, all popped by Song Yoon. Going to go in after Bang here. Bang could be in a lot of trouble. Yeah, Song Yoon trying to win this 1v1. Bang gets taken out. Wolf can't get there in time. A common mistake. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it happens all the time. Oh, Wolf getting way too close to that. Gets hooked. Box used by Snowflower, and that's a nice ult to get out of the way right before this dragon comes up. Really awkward yeah. right there to try and make that pick when you don't have very much damage for backup. Well, SKT, Silver Ultimate activated. Mickey makes it out. Kind of a weird Marin. way. Wow, Marin just gets 1v1 by Ixu. That was interesting. Uh, TP advantage to SKT for a brief time. Well, headbutt pulverized Song Yoon and Snowflower knocked up. Here come Faker and Bengi coming in, zoning with the gravity shield. Mickey doing a lot of damage to Bengi. There's a nice equalizer. Oh! Whoa! What a shockwave! That is huge. SK Telecom going to crush this team fight. Lyra sneaks his way out of this one. I don't know if he's going to be able to escape, but this is what SK Telecom does. Wow, Lyra does make it out, but... Uh, they have to do something around this edge. Now they're... Oh. Lyra, oh, oh, that's, oh okay. boy, that's a play of the year there. Wow, Shockwave brings Lyra in, he takes the lantern out. Snowflower catches Wolf, actually, brings him into the box. Wolf's so tanky, though, pops his ultimate teleport coming down, though. Ixu getting there, man protect. Wolf somehow makes it out. Ixu, though, manages to catch Bengi. Bengi goes down. So SK Telecom still losing someone there. Yeah, nice response from Anarchy, knowing that they had that TP up, even though it starts out poorly from Lyra. It's not a good play from Lyra, but... They end up getting a kill anyway. On the defensive, 
and there's a lot of tricks that Anarchy can pull, which is exactly what we're seeing right now. Oh, here we go. Oh, Wolf misses Flash. They couldn't catch Sanyun. There's Equalizer coming down, though. Sanyun taking the lantern out, but Mickey gets caught. Marin goes in for the kill. He gets it. Marin very, very low, too. Meanwhile, oh, they push Ixu back in the team fight, but that's going to help Ixu get on the bang. They need to be careful. Your Faker on the run as well. Bang in a lot of trouble. Gets back to his turret. Can Faker get over the wall? He can with his flash. He's played so many times on this Alistair. One of his best champions, oh, Faker, Faker gets, gets hooked. Grabbed. Snowflower on the other end making great plays, and Songyun picking him another kill. Just continue to play with vision on the outside. Bengi oh, again. Oh, Bengi gets grabbed. There's Equalizer coming through. Ixu over the top on the bang. Bang in a lot of trouble here. Faker not even getting a good opportunity to use that equal, uh, the Shockwave, rather. Double kill for Ixu. They wanted to. SKT, can they find this? There's the TP. Uh oh, Ixu coming in from behind. They get the mid turret, but what are they going to lose? Right on to Faker. Faker trying to get away as fast as he can. They've got that ultimate from Bang to speed him up. Turning around there. Bengi getting very low. Mickey doing a ton of damage. Ixu with another kill. Wolf able to get out of the hook with his ultimate, but look at this. Gets pulled back in. Faker gets a big shockwave, but there's no real follow-up. Bang does not enough damage as he has to flash away as well, too. Marin gets blown up. A double kill for Songyun. And even with that huge ultimate from Faker, they're just way too far behind. And that's going to be the game. Ace, Anarchy playing that very well. And without Marin's TP, the 5v4 just doesn't work. They get the good engage with Ixu. Surrender, uh, no, not quite yet. The camera is moving in a way I thought it might be, but nope, that's going to be about it. And SK Telecom dropping a game to Anarchy here. Wow, we're going to game three. Anarchy, well played. That's the GG. Well, they, they again answered blow for blow for SKT, and they played it out very well, not giving SKT very many options, played a patient game, much more patient than last time, and that'll net them the win. So a bit of off play, overly aggressive play from SKT, and it is capitalized on by Anarchy for yeah. the victory. Anarchy played great. I mean, uh, 